unang ko wallet. Ay, gawin na ako, Will. Nasa Planet Mars na ako. Dahil doon na yan. Kaya nandun na ako. Tapos, parang na akong lasing. Ganyan. So, wala na. Wala na ako. Wala na. Kung pagod ka na, mas pagod ako. Basta rin na ako. So, ako rin. Pero mahal ko kayo. Kaya kahit na ang tukaw ko, tatayo ako rito at papalakpak ako sa Panginoon kasi para sa inyo ito. Amen ba? Amen! Oh, ito ako. Kaya sa sinyo. Pastor, ah, uh, wala, wala. Ay, ba? Pastor, ah, uh, ano? Ah, mga kapatid, of course, I'm encountering the Lord. I also have an encounter with God kami. Pero, andun kami sa ano eh. Parang last. Kasi ito ay para sa inyo. So sabihin mo sa katabi, para sa inyo to. 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 Diba? Kung pinsin mo naman yung katabi mo, para sa inyo to. So, for a moment lang. For a moment. I just wanna sing this song. I just wanna sing this song yung, yung, hindi ko lang sabi to. But for a moment. Let's just sing this song yung, yung, fresh out for it. Isang ano lang, isang pasada lang. Isang pasada lang. And let's just ask God na we need your uh, fresh out for it. Unleash your fresh out for it. Right now. Lord, right now. We just need, I just need the verse, I just need the, 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 the chorus, the chorus part. Just the chorus part. Come on, I need to hear the version. Just the chorus part. Come on. Lord, thank you for this moment. And, umuulan sa labas, we are praying, umuulan din dito sa loob, Panginoon. Right now, thank you, Jesus, for your goodness, for your love. We love you, Jesus. Come on. Come on. Come on, church.
Let's come on, come on, come on. Let's declare. Everyone, let's lift our voice. Just tell him, Lord, how great you are. Diba? You have this, this, you received the encounter last night. So why not let's open our lips and, and declare the goodness of the Lord. So we find out, I want more of the encounter. I want more, I want more of the encounter. Right now, I don't know. Right now. And those who can spread the spirit, it's like spread the spirit. It's like the atmosphere right now.
turn off you. My help can help you. And tonight, you need desire the Lord na mas gusto niya magpakilala sa iyo. Ang tanong, gusto mo ba siya makilala ka? That's why, three songs na mabibigat yung pinatakayan. <laughs> Hindi ito yung plano ko, plano ko. Tingnan niyo yung line-up natin, masaya ka, but it's something na ang gusto ng Lord, hey, I, you can have rejoice in my presence, but right now, kakailangan ko lang ay yung anak ko. <laughs> At ikaw yun. Pwede ba sabihin mo sa katabi mo, ikaw yun. Ikaw yun, ikaw yun. Okay. Just scry and then I will shift. Hindi ko alam kung lumiyas siya tumamang ito. But I will shift. And I will give you only strictly, bro. I will only give you only strictly 15 to 20 minutes. But I believe, hindi ito planado. Dapat, basta hindi ito planado eh. <laughs> dapat kahapon siya eh. Wala, iba nga, mabulong. Tapos, bigla dapat kanina nakali siya eh. Dahil <laughs> kami hindi ito planado, pero pag ang Diyos ay nagplano, iba klase. Is it an amen? Amen! Kita nyo ngayon, may boses na ako, may energy na ako, sumisikap na ako. Mamaya, lumaypay na naman ako. Pero para sa Panginoon, gagawin ko ang lahat para sa Kanya. At anong gagawin mo rin bang lahat? Ano yung mga sakit na mo? Gagawin mo ba ang lahat para kay Lord? Gagawin mo ba? Gagawin mo natin ang lahat para kay Lord? Amen! Alam mo rin, gagawin mo natin ang lahat para kay Lord? Yes! So, God is good. Yes, mari hindi naman mga mag-bonfire. So what? Basta nang mahalaga sa atin. Hindi yung bonfire. Ang mahalaga sa atin, yun ang tibigay ng totoong apoy at walang iba po dyan pang inoong Diyos. Amen ba? Amen! So, um, no further ado, this is a man of God. This is a man of fire. Or, man of on fire. Okay? Man on fire. So, mukha lang siyang, sa so, mga hindi ko nakakilala sa kanya, mukha lang siyang hindi ganun pag wala siya dito. Pero kung nandito, nagbabago. So, so no further ado, I'm going to call si Kuya T. Pwede ba natin pala si Kuya T. And let's just let him come, just let him speak the word of God. Just tuloy na. Walang bibita, walang bibita worship. Okay, uh, great evening everyone. Uh, grabe na yung presence ni Lord ngayon. Uh. Actually, may doon na yung tayo nila. Lagi kang pumunta ng man. Um, I want to make a bold statement about this. I want to make a bold question about this. Do you encounter this kind of worship in the body, in the church? Di ba hindi natin ito masyado, hindi tayo masyado exposed sa ganitong worship, tama? But this kind of worship, this kind of worship is, ito yung inahanap ni Lord. Ito yung inahanap niya sa atin. Bakit? All He wants is not, is, is not, is not about your money. It's not about your, sabi nga doon, na offer your body as a living sacrifice. As a, as a living sacrifice, di ba? Wala, walang ibang bagay na hinihingi sa'yo, kundi yung katawan mo lang. Yung katawan mo lang na kayang, na kayang sumigaw, na kayang, na kayang ibigay lahat. That you're crying out your passion. That you're crying out everything. Just to give, just to give this desire. Because God is looking to your heart. God is looking. By the way, guys, my topic is all, all about this moment. is all about identity, di ba? Ah, uh, alam ko, nung, eh, yung iba dito, uh, yun, hindi ko pa alam yung identity ko eh. How, how, can, how can you say that you, you found your identity? You know what? When, uh, 22 years, 22 years na, I don't have any kind of relationship. But I'm Christian. Christiano ako, pero nagsisimba ako. And, and I'm from the Baptist Church. And you know what? I don't, wala akong nakita ng gantong relasyon, gantong kind of worship. Hindi ko naramdaman yun. Because you know what? In 22 years, I'm a hypocrite person. Sobrang hypocrite ako. And yung pinakamasakit, sinabi sa akin ng isang tao, ng isang isang kristyano, sabi niya sa akin, kristyano ka ba talaga? Yun yung pinakamasakit na pwedeng sabihin sa iyo ng isang kristyano, ng ako ang kristyano. Kristyano ka ba? Diba? And that moment, that moment for 22 years, um, inisip ko lang, Lord, for 22 years, sure na akin, yung tumata- tumakatok ka lang sa puso ko. And, and I don't have any idea na this kind of relationship, this kind of passion, this kind of desire. And I'm, hindi ko lang hindi ko ma-explain but but ganito ako kayo na kay Lord. Do you know what? 25. 25 Thursday, last Thursday. I've been in love with Jesus for one year and seven months. Yay, Jesus! Right? Kaya hindi na mo pinagmalaki na in love na in love ka kay Lord. 
Hindi tayo nandito sa hindi tayo nandito sa lugar na to ano to satisfy your needs. Guys, I just want to make a bold statement about this. You are not, hindi mo nabibigyan ng takot. Ay, alam mo, magiging prank ako sa inyo. Hindi natatakot si Satan na nandito ka. Hindi na, every Sunday mag church ka, hindi, hindi natatakot si Satan doon. But you know what? Kasi siya natatakot? Alam mo, kasi siya natatakot? Kapag uuwi, alam mo, uh, lalabas ka ng church, lalabas ka sa van. And you know what? Ano gagawin mo? Pupunta ka sa panto mo, pabagayin mo yung nanay mo ba? I love you. And fitting. Huwag mo yung bagay rin, imposible. Di ba? Pero ito yung ni, ito yung sinasabi ko sa inyo. Ni, ni konting, ni, ni konting, ano, takot, hindi mo nabibigyan sa Satan. Kung walang nagbago mo, pumunta ka ng church, pero paglabas mo, nothing change. But pero kapag tumuwi ka ng bahay nyo, binati mo yung nanay mo, and even though, hindi kayo pinapayagin, sinabi ang kanyang pinersikit kanya, sa kanyang naman galing, ha? Kung ano na magaling sa simbahan nyo, ganto ganyan, ganto ganyan, kung ano na sinasabi, pumunta sa kwarto mo, ang ginawa mo, ang ginawa mo, lumunod ka. Lumunod ka, pinakita mo ito, ay Diyo, ay Lord. And Lord God, Father, thank you in the name of Jesus that I'm suffering, Father God. And Lord, sinabi mo sa salita mo that those who desire to live godly will suffer persecution. And it's a promise from the Lord, guys. And I just want to make one statement about this. You are the sons, and you are the sons and daughters of God. Marami tayong bagay na pinaglalaban, marami tayong bagay na pinoproblema. But sinasabi ko sa inyo, everyone of you, everyone of you, kung ano yung ginagawa ni Kuya Adjon, kung ano yung ginagawa ni Jason, kung ano yung ginagawa natin lahat dito, it's the same purpose, it's the same thing na pinaglalaban namin dito. And alam mo kung ano yun? Yung ilaban namin yung identity nyo. Ipakita at ipakita namin sa inyo kung ano ba talaga yung identity nyo. At ano ba Kuya Tim? Gano, bakit ganun ka karadikal para, para ibalik yung identity mo? And you know what? When we... Ang, ano ko dito yung Genesis? Sabo sa Genesis. Naniniwala tayo, di ba? Nasa Genesis sabi that we are... Um, um, we are from the Adam and Eve. Tama ba? Tama ba? Right? And God is love. And man is love. Tama? We are all created in His image. He did it in... in ano, Genesis, Genesis chapter 1 verse 26. Hindi niya na sinabi sa 26 yun. He did it in 27. You know what? That's so very that's that's why go, wow! Hindi niya sinabi ni sa Venice yun. Pero sinabi niya that all of you na nandito sa kwarto to at lahat ng buong tao sa mundo was created by Him, by His image. You know what? The same destiny, the same purpose na nandito ako sa harap kayo. It's all by, it's, it's all by His grace that I'm, 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 I'm in this room. And you know what? For almost 22 years, I'm, I'm always, I'm always searching my identity. Sa ibang tao, sa sex. And you know what? Okay, um, I believe na um, God, is, God is directing me to, to tell you this kind of story. Si Kuya Tim, oh, makikita niyo siya, passionate siya. Pero Kuya Tim is a porn addict. You know what? Every time that I do that thing, yung tinatakot yung masturbation, nasasaktan ako. Every time na gagawin ko, oh, it, it, dadating yung boy's head, nasasatisfy nung. Pero ano nyo, every time na gagawin ko yun, sobrang naiiyak ako. Bakit? Ang sakit. Sobrang ang sakit. Kapag nakinaraman naman ko, the Lord God, ayoko ko gawin ito eh. Ayoko ko gawin ito. Bakit hinahanap ng flesh ko? In that moment, naging makasarili ako. Sinarili ko lang yun. And dumating yung point, dumating yung point na may nakausap ako ng isang tao. Dumating ako at sinabi ko sa kanya, and out of nowhere, nasa puso ko na gusto ko i-share sa kanya na I'm a poor addict, that I'm, I'm masturbating every night. And uh, nakaka, nakaka, sobrang yung, yung desire niya, parang pinupo ka yung puso ko habang sinasabi ko yun sa tao na yun. Na yung sabi ko sa tao ko yun, na bro, hindi ko gusto to eh. And that moment, I want to tell him it's crying at night. And sabi niya sa akin, no, no one bro, Uy, baka may gusto na ituro sa isi Lord to control that fire, to control that identity. Yung identity na nakita mo sa kanya, baka kailangan mong import yan ng direct sa mga tao. Nandito ka sa kwartong to, hindi para, hindi para i-satisfy yung indeserve mo. Nandito ka para i-satisfy si Lord lang mismo. And some of you in this room, tatingin sa akin, bakit? Kasi hindi pa akong hihinto magsalita. Tama ba? I'm sorry guys, but I'm really passionate about Jesus. Wala siya sinabi sa akin for almost one year and seven months but to share the gospel. Share sa kasi sa mga kabataan. Share sa ibang tao. 
If you're almost one year and seven months, ayoko na may nakikita. Every time, oh, sabihin niyo ng weirdo. Pero every time, natitingin ako sa isang tao na naman ang pupuntahan dito. It's heaven or hell. And the heaven is living inside of me. I just want to make, I just want to make bold statement about this that Jesus didn't die on the cross para mamunta ka sa langit. But He died on the cross para yung langit papunta sa iyo. That's really amazing. Sabi ko sa akin, that, 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 that yung, yung heaven na yun, we are here, that everywhere we go, there's this kind of presence of heaven, everywhere we go, everywhere guys. And sabi ko, sabi ko, oh, normal lang sa isang kristyano na mag mood swing. Kasi darating yung point na mawawala yung apoy. Pero, pero nung pinigaralan ko to, na Lord, bakit ba ako na-addict sa point? Na-addict ako sa point that every night that I desire that thing na kahit ayaw ng puso ko. And dumating, dum, dumating ako, na dumating ako sa, na habang nag-scroll up ako sa Facebook. I, I, I listened to this preacher na sabi na may kilala doon siyang isang tao na um, she, uh, she's a smoker. Na sabi na, every time na, ay, ayaw niya niyo, parang natuloy na si Pasyo ko. Na every time na hinihitit niya yung sigarilyo, every time na hinihitit niya yung sigar, si, sigarilyo, pinagpapasalamat niya na, Father, I thank you in the name of Jesus that I found my identity to you, that I found my value to you. Kaya hindi yung parang gawain ng isang hipokrit ng Christiano yun. And dumating ako sa point na hindi, hindi hipokrit ito yun. Bakit? Ang hipokrit ito, playmaker. Ang hipokrit ito, hahayaan ka lang yung magtumari. Pero you, that, that, that man, na gusto niyong baguhin na every time, na every time na hinihitin niya yung sigarilyo na yun. It's, na every time na hinihitin niya yung sigarilyo na yun, he's thankful that God, I found my identity to you, that in Jesus' name, in the blood of Jesus, that I found my identity and my identity to you. And this is what I'm to say in you guys, if you found your identity to Jesus Christ, your foundation was really amazing. By the way, guys, I'm here to tell you who you are, how amazing you are. You are not here in this, you are not here in this church. I, I just want to, kung hindi, paano mo sasabihin sa akin? Paano mo sasabihin sa akin na paano nakaka-amis yung buhay ko? Okay, ganito. Um, sa, sa pinakaunang-unang-unang part ng buhay mo, okay, nas, nasa isang kanal ka. Nasa isang kanal ka. And there was 80 million chances of you. May pupuntahan lang kayo yung 80 million na chances of you yun. May pupuntahan kayo na isang malaking bagay. And lahat yun, yung 80 million na yun nagunahan. And lahat yun, lahat ng lahat ng anday yung nagunahan. And I believe na hindi tayo yung nauna sa, na, nauna sa, sa bilog na yun. Sa unang bagay na yun. Pero, yung nauna na yun, akala mo, pa, akala mo pumasok ka na parang mayor. Parang pumasok ka lang doon. So, sino yung papasok doon sa ano yun? Sa tao na yun? Sino, sino yung papasok dyan sa la, sa ano na yan? Sino yung papasok kay nation? Sino yung papasok dyan? And then, ikaw yung boses mo, naririnig mo. Sorry guys, I, I was created by God and I was founded by Jesus Christ and may plano sa akin si Lord. Sipin mo yun, 80 million chances of you fighting for your life. Hindi, hindi ka dapat nandito kaya sasabihin ko sa inyo. Hindi ka nandito sa mundong to para mag-survive. You are here in this world to overcome. To overcome problems, to overcome sins, to overcome everything. Because you know what? Jesus overcome the world for 40 days. Pero how about us? Ilang taon na tayo, Kristiyano, hindi pa rin natin na overcome yung bagay na yun. Right? You know what? Jesus is the perfect example of everything. Jesus is the, per- the, the perfect author of my salvation. Sa kanya ko lang lagi inaasa yung buhay ko. And I don't know kung ano yung impact sa inyo na ito. Pero kung, kung nakikita yung passionate si Kuya Tim at kung ano yung mga naririnig ko sa kanya ngayon, I would just want to make one statement kahit anong, pre- kahit anong preach namin dito sa harapan, kahit anong turo sa inyo ni Pastor. Pero kung hindi kayo magiging good steward ng destiny mo, wala rin. Bakit? Ilang beses ko nang nakita to. I've seen a lot of Christians. Mga former Christians ng church na to. They lose their walk, they lose their focus to Jesus. Bakit? Nangibabaw yung emotion than faith. Nangibabaw na they live by emotion than faith. Na pinapipitawan yung bagay na to, pinapipitawan yung to para sa destiny, sa, sa, dahil nas mas makaabot ito sa identity nila. Ang ikaniwa nila, they make decisions by their own. 
but not by, by the decision of God. Sabihin ko sa inyo, hindi ko siya worship. Hindi, there, and, and, and at this moment, I just, I just, I just wanna, I just wanna say to my pastor right now, that there's a lot of things, there's a lot of times, I mean, there's a lot of times, na gusto ko nang bumitaw, ayoko na sa church na to, bakit ka nun si pastor, lagi na lang dyan sila sa akin, bakit ka nun Lord, and you know what, kung sasabihin ko sa inyo, kung alam mo yung identity mo, kahit na kailan, kaya mo balita rin yung kasinuwalingan niya, yung kasinuwalingan niya, bakit? Normal lang magalit ang isang kristyano, okay lang yan. Basta hindi mo naapektuhan yung destiny at yung identity mo kay Lord. Hanggat yung nabibuild up, hanggat yung, hanggat yung, hanggat yung pagsasama yung paggalit niya, nabibuild up yung identity mo, yung destiny mo, okay lang yun. Kain mo lang, sudin mo lang, follow your, follow your pastor, follow your leader, it doesn't matter. Kuya Tim, hindi ko na, hindi ko na naiintindi lahat, okay lang, hindi, hindi mo naiintindi lang lahat. Okay lang yan, because there will be a day, not today, not tomorrow, but there will be a day na maiintindihan mo lahat ng, per, lahat ng bagay na nangyari sa'yo. Amen. You're all amazing, guys. For almost 22 years, all I think of myself, I'm so selfish. That, oh, oh, we got, oh, we got. You know what? I declare. I declare that ang nakahapon pa, this is, not, this is our second encounter. But in our first encounter last night, I declare na, Lord, I declare na it's not the same issue na akaharapin ko pagbaba ko ng, pagbaba ko ng bundok na to. Amen. That I will face a new, I will overcome new stuff. I will overcome new things, new problems, Lord. New stuff this moment. Huwag kang bumaba. I declare mo sa sarili mo na hindi ka bababa ng bundok na to na the same, na the same thing, the same topic, the same hobby, na the same person, the sabi sa Bible, that would put off the old and put on the new. Di ba? Ikigay mo lang. Ikaw, so, dumating tayo lahat kay Lord. No, we are all new. We are all creation of Christ. We are all creation in the new things. That our mind, our heart, our soul is brand new. Hindi ka ito kapasyon si Kuya Tim. A lot of people sa Pasko, sinasabi nila, talaga preacher ka na? Talaga, kristyano ka na? Then when they, and then, then, when, hindi, 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 hindi ko ikakaya si Lord. Hindi, hindi, hindi ko ikakaya si Lord. Every time. You're all amazing, guys. You're all amazing. Hindi mo alam yung identity mo. Yung, yung, hindi mo alam yung identity mo. Hayaan mo maging instrumento yung band, yung leaders mo, every people in this room. Hayaan mo lang. Bakit? Don't worry guys, for three weeks, hindi ko na ginagawa yung backing na yun. Wala, pero, pero dumarating yung point na bubulong yung enemy. Pero kung doon na sabi ko sa inyo, babalik na rin ka lang siya. Na every time ako, sige, manood ka ulit, manood ka ulit. Bend my knees and pray to God. This is your stop at yun. Hindi, ko, hindi, hindi para maging ko kayo si Kuya Tim. Pero every time mapapasok sa isip na yun, I pray to Jesus. The Father, thank you in the name of Jesus that I find my identity, that I found my identity on you. On you alone. And at that moment, hindi ko na marinig yung boses ng alaban. But yung boses ng banan ng Spiritu Santo, hindi yung... It's always about the love of Christ. It's always about Him. It's not about us. But it's always about of the blood of the Son of God. That at this moment, Lord, I just want to end this, in this prayer. Father, I thank you in the name of Jesus right now. Everyone close your eyes. Holy Spirit, once again, just saturate their heart, their mind, their soul and put the passion, put the fire, put the everything, Father God, na makakatulong para mag-build up yung identity nila sa inyo, Panginoon. Help them, Father God, to overcome everything na humaharang para lang masira yung plano mo sa kanila. Help them, Father God, to build up and saturate their heart. And at this moment, 